George Stinney Jr. was born in 1929 in a segregated town in South Carolina. On March 23, 1944, two girls, Betty June Binnaker and Mary Emma Thames, went missing while riding their bicycles. Their bodies were found the next day showing signs of blunt force trauma. George Stinney and his brother were arrested based on information from an informant. He was interrogated without legal representation or witnesses, and he allegedly confessed to the murders. His trial lasted only two hours, with no substantial evidence presented in his defense. The all-white jury found George guilty, and he was sentenced to death. Protests and campaigns were held to save George's life, but Governor Olin Johnston refused clemency based on a description of George's alleged offense. George Stinney Jr. was executed on June 16, 1944, at the age of 14. In 2014, his murder conviction was overturned, and his sister expressed relief and gratitude. The case highlights the racial injustices and lack of due process during that time. 